You want to write a movie? Well, you can take courses, read books, study scripts, or watch four minutes from Toy Story 2 and learn just about everything you need. Before you start, you will have an idea, but what you really need is a premise or a concept. An idea can be to break into someone's dreams or a teacher cooks meth, but a concept is more like an exiled dream thief cannot see his kids until he plants an idea into someone's dream. Or a chemistry teacher with cancer has to earn $750,000 to provide for his family before his illness takes him down. A screen concept has the three foundational elements of the story baked into it. Toy Story 2 is about a toy that is taken away from his friends who have to go and save him. That concept from the 1996 script by Chamberlain and Webb appears in the finished film twice. The toy thief enters the script on page 8, but before he hits the screen, 15 minutes have passed, including a mini version of the entire film. In the big story, Woody is stolen by the collector and saved by the toy team led by Buzz, while in the short version, Wheezy is taken by Mom and Woody has to rescue him. This idea of foreshadowing the bigger story you may have seen before in The Dream from Total Recall or The Tapestry in Midsummer. This clip from Toy Story 2 is a mini story in its own right, and even if it has no immediate resolution, it still has all three core elements of a screen concept. You might have guessed that character goes first, but the reason character goes first has nothing to do with characterization or arcs, but everything with point of view. Watch our videos about the Sicario script and you'll see how critical POV is in getting the story right. Why? First, because we want to identify with someone on the screen and share their experience. But foremost, because we need the POV to define the other two concept parts. Find the POV character by asking, through whose eyes do we experience the story? Or which character is drawn into the story and compelled to act? In our clip, Woody is clearly that. That's one out of three done. If you have the movie's DVD or Blu-ray, have a look at the chapter title. It's called The Yard Sale. There is a really short chapter called Wheezy, but that doesn't matter now. The Yard Sale may work for the regular viewer, but for us it's pretty useless, because it only gives us a setting. There's no POV, no character, and surely no story. But wait, I hear you say, the Yard Sale is not just a setting, it's the inciting incident. Yes and no. It's indeed an event that triggers the emergency roll call, but no more than that. It does not trigger the need for Wheezy to be rescued, which is really what this mini-story is about. Then what is the trigger that we're after? Well, take two seconds to guess. It is Mum entering the room and taking Wheezy away. This I call the major event, and you may call it the inciting incident if you wish. Now what is the final element? If the first element is the character through whose eyes we experience the story, here at Woody, and the second element is the major event that affects him, mum taking Wheezy away, then what does this major event lead to? An action. Woody's action of saving Wheezy. Now there is a much better chapter title, Saving Wheezy. Of course, it's a bit of a spoiler, but clearly that wasn't an issue for other chapters. In summary, before we have a valid screen concept, we need three elements that work together, a point of view character, an event and an action. The POV here belongs to Woody, also our main character. The major event is Wheezy being taken away, without this no story, and Woody's action prompted by this event is to save Wheezy. Can you see how this short sequence is a perfect example of a cinematic concept? It has a clear POV, a powerful major event and a compelling visible action. And it is strong enough that on that same concept you can build an entire feature film, Toy Story 2. You enjoyed that? Well, why not subscribe? And once you have your story craft down, we can help you with screenwriting style. Check out www.screenwriting.courses. By enrolling in any course, you're supporting me and the channel. And guess what? I'll give you a 40% discount with the code TOYSTORY40. The details are in the notes below the video. Happy watching, happy writing. Cheers.